get a painted picture. Yeah. And then we're gonna sell it for millions of dollars. I need to be We got painting with a twist own boss edition. Probably wondering what that means. We're gonna unload the skid steer. We're gonna attempt to open up a paint a can of paint with the bucket and one of the little openers. I don't really know what they're called. And then once we get that open, we're gonna have a couple colors. We're gonna have the easel up with the canvas on it. And then we're gonna attach a paintbrush, a real little one, to the front of the bucket. And we're gonna work on painting a picture. And I'm gonna become Picasso because we're gonna make it look so freaking sweet. Maybe we'll even take it to like a, an art show or something and try to sell it. When you win, you could utilize the skid steer to paint pictures and sell them for a living instead of digging holes. You gotta hey. think outside of the box. You know, this is gonna be a super easy thing to do. Paint a full-blown picture with the skid steer. Well, let's go in the store, get our supplies, and get ready to make a sweet video. And there's more in it. And water. Do we need anything else from here? Ice. Ice, buckets of paint. How many gallons do you need to paint a like three by four picture? Three by four picture? I mean, painting with the skid, we're probably gonna need four gallons of paint. Four gallons of paint, all right. Oh, we need the paint popper too. Man browsing his options right now. I think we're gonna need this to spread the paint quite well. That's a thick boy. Ooh. We're gonna need to get them to mix some paint for us. A blue and a white and a green. What is it, Roy G. Biv? Red, RGB? Green. Red, green, blue? Yeah. No, 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 no. Roy G. Biv. Isn't that what it is? <laughs> Absolutely. No, I'm serious. Like, Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple? Roy G. Biv, baby. I see, I'm not as stupid as I, you made me feel stupid for a minute, <laughs> Mitch. We need to get one of each color so we can be professional painters and make this thing look legit. We're gonna mix it all up. We're gonna do everything with the skid steer. Gonna move this out of our way so we can get the correct paint selection. Brilliant blue. I mean, that's kind of close. Which one's closer? This one? Mm, that. Yeah, that one. This one? Yep. So that'll be the setup. Um, this will be the sun. We are in Florida, so the grass isn't quite like Michigan grass like this. So uh, we'll go with a little bit of that burnt grass look. So we'll go with this color. What else do we got, Mitch? What else do we need to portray the background? Mm, you're gonna need a black. We got the secondary. Good call. The color is called black magic. I think this will paint every. Oh no, we need a background. Train. That's really what it's called, is train. Train. Hey! So we got turning oak leaf, moss point green, black magic, train, and um, adventure. Nice. I think uh, we'll be able to paint a Picasso level painting with this skid steer. If we don't, we're gonna have some issues. I'm gonna have to paint pictures with skid steers until I'm good as Picasso because I don't like to fail. We're gonna get it. I'm telling you, we're gonna get Chris's it. Chris's new project. So as soon as you walk out, you get to the right, it's right, right there. Down the road. What'd you say? Lowe's is right down the road too. So which one would you recommend, Home Depot or Lowe's? Home right Depot's there. like right there. Yeah. Can I steal these paint swatches then? Yeah, you can keep those. Those are for you to keep. I'm gonna paint a picture today. What's that? I'm gonna paint a picture today. Oh. With a skid steer. Awesome. <laughs> I'm excited to see it. I'm gonna paint a picture today. Where did our cart go? We had we a cart? things in the cart? I guess we did. <laughs> there it is. Found it. <laughs> Can you help us find that Zephyrillus? Oh, I found the Zephyrillus. Zephyrillus. Mitch, how do you say that? That is a Zephyrillus. Respect. You know what we're gonna do? Huh? You know what a skid steer is? What's that? A skid steer, you know, the machines that you pick up dirt with? Uh-huh. So that's what we have. We have one of those and we're gonna paint a skid, uh, we're gonna paint a picture no, with one. Slide that way. Oh, really? What's your website in there? Home Boss Supply Co. Okay, give me the your website so I can look at it. There we go. 56.79. We are headed to Home Depot, then Hobby Lobby. We gotta get the rest of the paint supplies to uh, become Picasso. Picasso? Picasso. We got a big old body lift, boys. It's a two to three inch body lift. <laughs> How was this thing locked? They just tried to open the door, and now the alarm's going off. Steve's inside. Um, why did the door open? And the alarm go off. I don't even know. <laughs> and that's how you properly put a card away. Can we ask you a couple questions about the truck? Yeah. So, seeing it right here, yeah. what's your guys' favorite part about it? The paint match. The paint color. match? 
Have you ever seen one paint match like that before? No. no? Real quick, what's your guys' names? Uh, Dylan. Dylan? Bryce. Jason. Jason. Good to meet you. Do you guys work with any machines or anything? Forklifts. Forklifts? Yeah. Are you okay. Forklift certified? Yeah. No. That's how you pick up all uh, the I run Yeah, sometimes. Just so you guys know, you can actually take this entire setup home. Yeah, we give it away. We give yeah. setups like this away every six weeks. Yeah. Home Boss Supply Co. Follow us on Instagram. Check it out. It's pretty sweet. Nice. Grades are where it's at. Yeah. Yep. People don't realize thinking college is, I mean, for some people, college is the right move, but if you don't know what you want to do, it's a waste of money to go to college. Off right. the Home Depot? Yeah. We'll see you guys. Yeah. Thank you guys. Yeah. She's a neck breaker. And we've arrived. We've arrived at the Home Depot. We're gonna have a mix up some paint for us. We're gonna grab some clamps and a couple other things. Then we gotta hit Hobby Lobby to grab uh, a canvas and uh, we're gonna get to painting. These new lawnmowers look futuristic as f Look at that thing. It's like boxy. This is something I feel like I should see at the auto show. Isn't it? Isn't it wild? <laughs> yeah, I mean. I think we might need to get the double whammer. or Double pack. Ooh, that's a quadru That's a quadruple that pack. Hard. I think this is gonna be best bang for our buck. This one's thirty six dollars, and everything else is like twenty five to thirty bucks. So might as well get the big boy. Well, we got a problem. It's uh, not right here. These are grills. They uh, mislabeled the stores. We got some paint selection here. This blows Walmart out of proportion. How's it going? Good. What's going? What's the uh, the cheapest paint you guys have. Blin. Can I get one gallon of each? Where do these colors from? Walmart? Okay. You want you want us to grab similar swatches? Yeah, well, Yeah. Here I got you. I can do it. No, we can do it. Hope over here. Oh lady. Big tall. Big tall. There's one, Steve. Beauty. Green. What kind of what kind of paint match we got going on here? That's that's <laughs> impressive. This is why I don't pick the this is why I don't pick the skit. <laughs> <you do> this? <laughs> I leave that one to Frank. Dude, I'm not good at paint match. Man. I mean, honestly, you put you put this on your ceiling, this on the wall. I don't. That'd be good. But uh, this is going on a canvas for the skid steer, so let's we'll see how this goes. You know what? This is close enough. I like it, dude. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Okay, like completely different greens, but I mean, look at this. This is this is Florida green. It's a little burnt. Too much Michigan, bro. Tell me I don't have the black perfect on. Oh man, tough one to match. <laughs> I appreciate that shit talking over there. <laughs> hey, that's pretty damn close. Hey, if you ask me, that's pretty darn good. Oh yeah, that's almost right hey, there. Hey, as you guys can see, my paint matching got better from swatch one to five. <laughs> it was brutal the first one, second one was not much better. Third one got decent, when I got black, I got that. How long do you think? 15 minutes. Thank you. 15 minutes later. I couldn't find the tart, bro, it's camouflage. <laughs> We are currently on the phone with a dealership in New York securing the deal on OB18 truck. You're not gonna know what it is for another couple weeks, maybe a month, whatever it is now, but I'm literally sitting on the phone with that dealership and uh, we got the old gold Amex out, putting a deposit on OB18 truck. It's gonna be... Yes, I'm still here. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have officially wrapped up with our Home Depot stop. It took almost an hour. We got yelled at for filming inside Home Depot. If you film the registers, you will get yelled at because Home Depot, supposedly from our nice friend in New York or New Jersey, wherever he was from, told us that Home Depot gets 900 million, almost $1 billion worth of merchandise stolen a year. I don't really understand how that adds up. On to the next step. We will see you guys at Hobby Lobby. Tell me why I want this so bad. <laughs> That's sick. This is for Peter. Star Wars edition. Peter. This Peter. Is Peter Story. Peter. <laughs> Look, more. Peter. <laughs> Peter. Uh, canvas. Uh, now we need an easel, right? Yeah, yeah. Next aisle. <gasps> Let's see what we can run into on the way out. Yep. All right. We're gonna go make some art projects. Good. I wanna. I wanna see pictures of it. Oh, we got you. You too. <laughs> we're painting with a skid steer. A full okay. size with a skid steer with a bucket on the front. We're painting with it. He's gonna. He's gonna paint a picture. Nice. Picasso style. Nice. <laughs> and then we're gonna sell it for millions it. of dollars. And we're I gonna like retire. It. I need to be your friend. Oh, well, you can. Come on. Let's go. We're gonna go there. Right? If we put a tarp down, can we do it in the parking lot? Yeah, I don't have the authority to tell you yes or no on Who that. Who does? That would be the plaza manager. Is he uh, here? I don't know where they are. Fair enough. All right. Thank you. But you guys have fun. You too. Have a good one. We're gonna paint pictures today. 
We only got one more stop. We're gonna stop at Chase Bank real quick. We gotta pick up the uh, cashier's check for the OB18 truck because you know we can't just do one thing at a time. We gotta do like 97 things at a time. We got the canvas. There's only one of those. You definitely didn't see two. Let's head to the bank, go grab this check. We got some paperwork to sign up on OB18 truck. And then we're gonna unload the skid steer. And I'm gonna teach you guys what I was put on this earth to do, which I am so, so, so emotionally passionate about. <laughs> Heavy equipment art. It is gonna be the next popping thing for all of the super rich, wealthy people that pay hundreds of thousands of dollars. For artwork, they're gonna be buying our artwork. Thank you very much for watching. Okay. Well, ladies and gents, I know this is part 7,922 of this video, but we have officially made it to the world famous Chase Bank. We're picking up the cashier's check for OB18. The paperwork is getting sent in to our house in Florida. Hopefully tomorrow, because I ask them to overnight it. They don't seem to understand the urgency in my voice, but maybe I don't portray it enough, but I feel like I do, because I told them I really want the truck now. It's in New York. We're gonna have it shipped down immediately. The goal is to have it here by the end of next week. So. We can start on the build. The trailer's here. All we gotta do is find a skid steer and paint a freaking picture with this thing. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have the check. As you can see, this stuff is about as legit as it gets. I'll block off all the numbers, but look, $74,000. And I already put 2,000 down, so we paid $76,000 for this truck. We spend the money, we do it for real. The best of the best, it's a I can't tell you yet. Ah. You'll have to see it. <laughs> now that we have stopped, uh, I think 9,000 times, we are officially ready to head to the spot where we're going to unload this beast and start Picasso painting. Sorry. We'll see you there. We are here. Yes, sir. How are you feeling? I'm freaking all jacked up. All ready for this? Let's unload this Johnny. Get the easel set up. Let's get to paint, bro. quite familiar with what this tool is right here. This is what you would get when you were a little kid walking around Home Depot with your dad and your mom to open up paint cans. And uh, these are meant to be used with your hands, but today we're gonna use the skid steer bucket. We got a handy dandy DeWalt clamp. We're gonna clamp it to the bucket, open all five of our paint cans, as you can see right there. To paint our picture, we definitely, I think, underbought on paint, if I'm gonna be completely honest with you. Let's uh, install our paint can opener, because I don't know the technical term to this thingy mabobber. I think that's a technical term. Well, let's install it to this kid's steer bucket. Let me do a little quick how to install. It's gonna be as simple as center it up on the front of your bucket. We are almost there. And just like that, you have a, a pretty hefty, strong paint can opener. Well, let's, uh, let's open these paint cans. You are it's the skid steer now. It's actually 2023, and I identify as a skid steer, so <laughs> this uh, will work for the video. Well, let's go get the paintbrush. I have all five colors used to paint this exact background that we're looking at. Now, I'm gonna hook this up to the bucket, and I'm gonna show you the most amazing painting you've ever seen in your entire life. And if you don't like this, I don't like you.
ladies and gentlemen. Just like I previously mentioned, this right here is what you call a work of art. This is actually why they call it artwork because this is exactly what I had in my mind when we we planned this project. I mean, I'm 27 years old and this has been my mind since I was uh, walking about 26 years ago. So this is what they call a piece of art. It's gonna sell for a lot, like a lot. I'm thinking, uh, like I said, in that seven, eight figure range. I, mean, I don't know if you guys see it like I do, but this was the spot I'd always dreamed of. The same Pantones, same everything. I mean, it's absolutely next level perfect. And this is it's gonna be at auction. We're not quite sure where, but it'll be somewhere. We just gotta, um, don't mind that. That gets look beautiful on any, any high-end collection. Or we'll trade it for supercars, our skid steers. So cool trucks, whatever you got. Appreciate you watching the video. Stay tuned for that link. So you could potentially be the one owning this world famous first skid steer painting in the world. Well, we take the easel. We didn't have a hammer. So. You gotta make it easy with the easel. <laughs>